Too late. What up, what up, what up? Good night to everybody. <laughs> Where's your phone at? Do you, you pull up the... It's in the house. I don't know. On the charger? Yeah. What up? What up? What up? What up? What up? What up? Two in the pink, one in the stink. Shut up. <laughs> What's good, everybody? What's good? What's good? What's good? Hey, what did you say? Desiree, back to work for me. Smoke one. Oh, back to work for me. Smoke one for me. Mile high. Show. What's good, Drake? What's good? What's good? What's good, Amanda? Anonymous, John, Eric, what's good? Yeah, it was popping. I was gonna go live on, uh, I was trying to do the Patreon live. <laughs> My computer's dead, and I think you can only go live if you go to the actual website on a computer on Patreon, because I was trying to do it on the app, and it just was not working. So I was like, you know what? Instead of just giving up and not going live at all, we'll just go live on YouTube. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So we here, we here. Got three joints ready to go. Hey, yeah, let's smoke one. Oh, I'm sorry. Does that hurt? Yes, it's a fucking bruise. Oh, my bad. Why are you so bruised? Because of you. You got all that rough sex. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, William? What's up, Maria? I know you're close by as well. Hope you guys are doing good. Sorry about that. You know, y'all was definitely, I know, in there. Y'all was going to be in the live regardless because y'all was ready for the Patreon live, too. But yeah, I couldn't quite figure out how to do it. So I figured the best thing to do was to probably go. Now you're, you're kind of sitting far away. You're the one that don't have it on there, right? What do you mean? You're sitting too far back. You're not like. Because you're turned this way. Because I don't like this. I can't sit next to this. But you can screw right here in front of me. That's not. That's the same amount of space as if I was turned the other way. Okay, hold on. All right, but anyways. Yeah. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> okay. No, no. Look, scoot up and look a little bit more. There you go. And I could do that. Then I could do that. Your head is too big. Your head's too big. There we go. What up, what up, Ryan? What up, what up? I just ate six pieces of weed caramel and now I'm fitting. You fitting to smoke? Fitting to smoke? Huh? I'm fitting to smoke. Mm -hmm. Look out, satellites. Here I come. I'm fitting to smoke. Hey, you're high. <laughs> hey. You're high. Hey, hey, hey. Just a little bit high. But How you that have. Hurts. That bra hurts. Take it off. Earn us some money. <laughs> <laughs> just playing. Chill out, bruh. Fuck you just say to me. Earn us some money. You get us some money. Damn. Alright. I'm with it. I'm gonna start pimping myself out. Please do. <laughs> Shut up. Please. Please uh, what up, everybody? <laughs> LOL. I'm making yeah. some money. LOL, my ass. Yeah. I hope you guys are doing fantastic today. I hope you guys are doing great. I hope today was a beautiful day for everybody. It was hot as fuck. It was a pretty good day still. It was hot, but like, it wasn't as bad. There's definitely been a few days that were even hotter this last week. You Bad get thing. paid, you sexy beast. Yeah, I know. I know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Are you jealous for now? Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> She's a little jealous. 
I should go. Get on the track. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna walk these yes, streets. Go be a night me. walker. I'm gonna go be a night walker. Be on these streets. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go get in these streets. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go get in these streets. D Robinson. I'm gonna go get in D these Robinson. streets. D Robinson's the man. What up? What up, brother? What up, brother? What up, bruh? Hope you're having a good day. Good night. I guess it's a good night. Good night for everybody. I hope everybody's having a beautiful, beautiful night. Because uh, I don't think there's really anybody in here. If you're, if you're, unless you're in a different country on um, like the other side of the world, you're still just in the night. Oh so, my God, it feels good right now. I hope you guys are all having a beautiful, fantastic, beautiful, beautiful night. You know what I'm saying? Fantastically, wonderfully beautiful. From Australia. Don't worry, you sexy too, Renee. <laughs> Maria came through for you. Girl, I be trying. But I'm just saying. Monday lunchtime here. Wait, what? Oh. You said what? He said. Alan Clark? Damn, Monday lunchtime? Where the hell are you at? <laughs> Oh, yeah, and then I got a important update for you guys. So I bet you a couple of you guys were just wondering, like, what happened? Australia, yeah, okay. A bunch of you, I'm sure, were wondering what happened to the Words of Chaos thing today. Um, and I had a really weird situation with that. Um, I don't want to... I don't want to say the dude's name. You know, I don't want to, like, start problems. Uh, but I'm sure you guys could kind of figure it out. We had a we had a, a member delete his poem entry off of, off of YouTube. And he ended up taking it, like, a whole step further. And... Like, just deleting everything and anything that was, like, a part of us. Like, you know what I'm saying? I hit him up, just, like, check on him, see. You know, literally was just like, yo, I hope you're having, you know, hope you're doing okay. Um, you know, because I noticed he had deleted me off of everything. And he, like, literally wrote me back, huh? Like, she'll vouch. I showed her the messages. He wrote me back and was just like, yo, why are you messaging me? I left, you know, you and all my demons behind or all the demons or something. Like, bro, it, went, it got really weird. Um, and then on top of that, so like, not only do we have this first or this second week be like a, uh, a default winner, if you will, because someone quit for next week, I really didn't have any other entries. So I'm kind of just like, I'm taking a step back from that. And I think we're going to redo the situation. We're going to kind of come back at it from a different approach, different angle, and maybe just get, I want more people to get involved. You know what I'm saying? I was hoping that more people would get involved. And maybe that was my fault because I didn't push it hard enough. Um, maybe I just didn't get enough people aware of what was going on. Um, so I think we're going to try to re, we're going to step back from it and then redo it. You know what I'm saying? Reevaluate it. The two winners that have already won, they're going to automatically get spots um, on the next one. You know what I'm saying? Like when we redo it. They don't got to retry or re-enter or anything like that. They're going to automatically get spots. Um, so, yeah. But it was just really weird, man. It was a, it was a really weird situation, bro. Um, yeah, I don't know how to take it. And then so, like, yeah, because that on top of already not having, like, enough entries as it was, it just was like, all right, we'll just go ahead and step back from this and re redo it when we got all our ducks in a row. That makes sense. Yeah. Yeah, I figured it's always got to be something. I know, man. Yeah, but no, I'm going to still do some Words of Chaos stuff. But as far as the contest goes, like I said, there just wasn't enough entries. There wasn't enough people for me to even put. I didn't even have two entries this week. I only had one poem that I was going to enter, and I was the one that was going to read it. And yeah, and I was like, well, that, you know, kind of defeated the purpose of the whole situation. So I was just like, that's 
Like, it's, it's pointless, you know? Like, it kind of just, it, it died before it got rolling. We lived, we learned, you know what I'm saying? We'll just retry the situation a little bit different and just better. You know what I'm saying? Go away, you stupid fly. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, spark up, dab up, vape up, dip up, moonshine up, sweet tea up, do you do you scoop? Yep, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, moderated. Desiree, you've been in here for a while. Oh, I can't do it off of here. Dang, I can't. Oh, yeah, I can. Boom. Yeah, Desiree, you're a moderator now, too. But yes, those are all the moderators. Those are the people who can kick people out when they're getting unruly. My bad. I need to. Here, will you scroll this down? There we go. Hold up. And that was, that was one I wanted to see. What up, Craig? You should reach out to CJ Wallace, Biggie's kid. He has a cannabis company. He's looking for influencers in the pod community to help him with marketing. Yeah, I'll check him out. Or maybe you should, maybe if everybody goes and hits him up and sends him my way, you know what I'm saying? Let's him know what we're doing over here. I'll be down. What up, what up, Jennifer? How's it going in the down under? <laughs> And I'm a straight man, Renee, so no worries. I'm just comfortable with my sexuality because I can tell another man he's looking good. <laughs> Don't be jelly. Just be lucky. You're both beautiful people. Aww. Go away, you stupid fucking fly. Sparka. Oh, yeah, I was about to fucking sparka when I fucking started reading these. Oh, that makes sense. Seems like a large number here. Yeah. Never had to use my moderator privilege, though. So we all family up in this bitch. Facts. That's real shit. I've only had to kick somebody out like once or twice. I've had to put people on timeout and shit. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes some people just need to be on fucking timeout. They just need to be, you know what I'm saying? Put on timeout. What up, Cracker Jack? What up? So, spark up. First time swag, baby. First time swagger. <laughs> From Knox, Vegas. Me and Jacob wrote a rap, y'all. <laughs> oh, you want to rap it to him? No. It's called Baby Mama Be Stressing Me and Baby Daddy Be Stressing Me. <laughs> what did mine go like? I can't, I'd have to read it. <laughs> I'd have to read it. And I would pull mine up, because I could pull it up on my computer, but my computer's fucking dead. So, yeah. I think he wants to make a video to it. Yeah, we're going to make a video to it. And it, because it's it would be cool. Weed smoking spear, brother, is awesome. <laughs> Yo, Craig, if you're still in here, what's up with that Biggie thing? Or CJ Wallace? I'm always down to see what's up. You in church got me smoking blunts over bongs. Because blunts are great, bro. Grunts are great. Brunts are great. Yeah, brunts are great. <laughs> blunts are great. Blunts are great. But, uh, and then Alan, Alan is the one, I think, wasn't it Alan? I think, no, it wasn't Alan. Yeah, it was. It might be Alan that I was, that sent in the poem. He would have been the win the winner this week. <laughs> I think he was the other one that I had for this week. That was the only one I had this week. So I was like, well, shit. Yeah. He said, no, not me. No, not him. No, then it wasn't Alan. I think his name was, it was kind of like Alan. No, no, it wasn't Alan. It just started with an A. It just started with an A. The dude was from Ireland. He's from Ireland. With a fishing, smoking, rap video. <laughs> I'm so high. I'm drywall lines. What? Hold up, that shit went too fast. Some drywall lines are messing up with me. Oh, <laughs> the drywall lines. I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about? Blunts are fucking great. Weed is great. You guys are right. What up, Judith? Yeah, my bad. I know you were waiting for us over on the Patreon. I couldn't figure it out. So I was like, you know what? We're not going to not go live. We're just going to have to figure out how to do the Patreon thing and do that again probably sometime this week. And then, yeah, so we just came over here <laughs> so we can still hang out. Will you push it up? Because my hand keeps going in front of the camera, so it's like they got to look at my arm. Well, I guess if I do it like that. There we go. Yeah, almost 2.5 million views for total views. Yeah, no, we, we, that's pretty crazy to think we've got 
over 2.5 million views almost in less than a year. Because you got to remember, mm -hmm. I'm still under a year. I think September 2nd was when I officially uploaded YouTube for the first time as like, I'm taking this serious. <laughs> so we haven't quite hit September 2nd yet. So once we hit September 2nd, I'm officially a year, wow. a year into YouTube. Yeah. Just left me a message on Instagram for sure. I'll check it when I get off of here. Oh yeah, what's good, Jackson? I just saw you jump in here too. I'm pretty sure I just saw your name. Yeah, there he is. What's up, homie? I started a Patreon too. It's cool as hell. Hell yeah, yeah, no, the Patreon's dope, man. It allows people to support you, allows people to just, you know, help. You know, because that's, that's the beautiful thing about this world, man, is people do want to help. You just have to give them a reason to want to. And that's, what I've had, that's what I've realized is it's not whether people do or, or will help you. It's just give people a, a, a reason to help you. You know what I'm saying? When you can give somebody a, a reason to get behind you and want to fucking, you know, see you win, like, people are amazing. They will definitely do so. That's why everybody's sitting in here now. It's because people want to see us win. You know what I'm saying? They want to see us do dope, dope things. They want to see us do some amazing fucking things. You know what I'm saying? So it's 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 amazing, man. <clears throat> yeah, see, Zach is real shit. Poseidon, that's the homie right there. Like, he's the reason, like, all you guys need to personally thank him. I know you guys have, but I'm always about showing that love. Him and his wife are the responsible for us why we have the GoPro and all the accessories for the GoPro. And you know what I'm saying? We're able to do so much dope content with better quality. Or you know what I'm saying? Or even just being able to fucking get the content because I had a camera in the first place. So, you know, thank thank him. That's the homie right there. That dude has done a lot for us. Sorry, Amanda, but he don't shut up. She don't want to be talkative. She don't try to talk. I do try to talk. Mm -mm. I tried to donate to PayPal. <coughs> and then it didn't work, so I dropped it to you on the PayPal. Yeah, I, oh, that was you, bro? Appreciate you. That was you? I did notice it was like this random, like, PayPal $3, $3 come through. I was like, oh, I <laughs> hell yeah. I did think, send you a little heart back. I see you tried to play me on that little video because I posted my dad, but you're not about to play me. I dot my I's and cross my T's, homie, okay? Get out of here. <laughs> Well, Jacob kicked me out because I didn't smoke weed. <laughs> get out of here, wild turkey. <laughs> oh, get out of here. You've been rocking with us too long. You've been you've been rocking with the high fam for a hot minute. Since I want to say under a thousand. I want to say wild turkey's been here for a fucking hot minute. But what's good, trap? You know what I'm saying, bruh? What's popping, brother? Fuck you on, dog. What you on, dog? Yeah, I would never kick somebody out for fucking not smoking. That's like the dumbest reason <laughs> ever. Yeah, that's right. I, I he's remember. He's ATL. Yeah, he's out there writing. He's out there doing, like, he's actually working. He's not out there just. How did you lose it. all that weight? Eating better. Like, and how? he started working out. Oh, yeah. I'm not trying to work out. No, he but he lost like 20 of it or 25 of it by just changing his diet and just eating better. I eat good. And then the rest of it was just working out. He's trying to get down to like my weight, he said basically. No. A, little, a, little, a little more, a little more than me, but. Your head is too big. <laughs> Not you good. Yeah, you'll be all right. No, I think what he said, like 190 or some shit, or 205 or some shit. He was trying to be somewhere in there, 190, something, something like that. He said, eggs, eating them eggs. Yep, facts. He definitely believes in I'm not trying to work. Yeah, out. see, he's at 200 now. So, yeah, because I want to say we were talking. He's like, I'm, he was trying to get at like one, I think it was 185 or 190, if I'm if I'm correct. Mm -hmm. I could be wrong, but I, I remember him saying he, was, he wasn't quite done. Um, Hell yeah, man. You lost 75? That's beast. <laughs> Congratulations. I need to lose 75. In the last year and a half, doing what? God damn. Comes with just working I lose out. I lose ten pounds and then I'll uh, gain two pounds and then. Look, she says she'll send you Insta pics. Yes, I'm excited. 
I was 232 January or wow. July 1st, and he's trying to get to 195 by next week. Bruh, that's half of your head, though. You don't want to lose your head. He's not going to lose his head. Yeah, I don't need to lose no weight. I just need to start working out. That's all I have to do. <laughs> if I just work out, I just... And just get muscle. <laughs> I just be lazy. I, he said I lost 180, got a divorce. Ooh. Damn. Well, at least you look good, so you can go be a hoe. You know what I'm saying? Go get back into that groove, bruh. Be a hoe? Yeah. That's the advice you gonna give me? <laughs> go be a hoe? He got a divorce. Get back out there and enjoy fucking life. Shit. Many fish in the sea. Oh, I <laughs> Fire advice, see? Anyway. <laughs> what the fuck you mean? He just got a divorce. He was just locked down. <laughs> you better go enjoy yourself. Shit. Seafood diet, yes. When I see food, I eat it. <laughs> mm -hmm. A stripper. I'm only 179. Want to get down to 165. Yeah, anyway, wild turkey. Nobody Not cares about fat. your fucking... <laughs> Bullshit pounds you gotta lose. <laughs> yeah, me and you weigh about the same size then, Wild Turkey. I jump, I fluctuate between 160 and 180. Like, I just, like, I have, like, this 20-pound, <laughs> like, grace period difference. <laughs> like, I can't, I can't really get over 180 anymore unless I'm really, like, just overeating and trying. And I seem to, like, cap out around one, like, 60 like I don't really get smaller than 160 I was actually beefing with a 67 year old lady about the same game <laughs> uh, win the elevator today over that game damn <laughs> what's a burly man like do you mean like Harry like, you kind of just like a, a stocky kind of hairy dude, or was that what you mean, like burly? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> 150 is my cap here lately. Yeah, you was pretty small. Zach, I could see you only being about 150. Mm. Yeah, stocky and big. Yeah, I see. He made up the word burly. <laughs> <laughs> he made up that word. <laughs> I've heard it before. No, nah, I was just saying, yeah, like when he said it, I was like, I'm like, I, I understand. I feel like I understand what that word is Me supposed too. to mean. <laughs> <laughs> Do you, are you feeling like a dude carrying an axe? No. Like those are burly dudes. <laughs> you just say a dude carrying an axe. Yeah, that chop down trees. <laughs> <laughs> like a lumberjack ass nigga. He said exactly. That's exactly what he oh, is. He's okay. like, I'm a lumberjack ass swinging okay. motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? You could chop down a tree. Okay. <laughs> All I'm, right. I'm trying to come back. Whenever you want to come back, man, we here. We are here. Whenever you ready, man. The lumberjack, yeah. And when you do come this time, you need to bring your recording shit, because we're going to record. We're going to put a track down. I'm ready. Whenever you want to come back. My throat is so dry. Go get us a water, man. You go get us some water. I didn't complain about a dry throat. But your shit is dry. But it ain't. Whatever. <laughs> I just watched that Ohio vlog. Of Ohio. Oh, uh, you talking about Trap. I was like, I didn't have an I ain't never been to Ohio. But Trap was just in Ohio before he was uh, in Atlanta, where he's currently at. I was booked at this strip club. Wait, I threw. Really? Oh, I threw all the club's money. That's what he was meant to say. Threw. He just put the wrong one. What the fuck? Because <laughs> he said you were saying he like because the clubs will book you. And then they'll give you money. To yeah. Throw. Yep. I thought you you should have kept that shit. I would have threw, threw like a third of it. <laughs> put the rest in my pocket. Fuck that. Fuck. They be like, yeah, y'all know we have somebody booked tonight. Give me all my fucking ones back, ho. Yeah. Was there, did you have to sign like some paperwork saying you was going to throw all of it? Shit, I would have lied through like a third. 
maybe maybe half if I was feeling generous. I feel like the rest I would have kept. I would have punched you. Why? Because remember that one time I flipped out on you? That's because you just don't handle strip clubs well unless you're by yourself. No. Dude. She's too jealous. She got mad one day. We went with her friend. And I get like I went and got ones for all of us. Her and her friend are sitting at a table, and I gave her friend some money to try to help cheer her up. Like here, throw some money at this girl, and she had a fit, like lost her shit, like <laughs> to the point where we were sitting outside of <laughs> outside of the car because she got in the car and locked herself in the car by herself. And I had to just sit outside the car, basically, until <laughs> she was ready to let me in. Because I was just like, wow. So I just sat there, and I happened to have a blunt. So I just sat there outside the car smoking weed until she fucking opened the door. And yeah, then we drove home, and I was like, yep. And we ain't never been back to the strip club together ever again. Oh, yes, we did. We went with Trap. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right. We did go and trap that. And he was like, where's the girls at? Well, because we had, remember, we ended up going so late. <laughs> he was like, where's their booty at? Yeah, we did go. We ended up going. Oh, watch your foot. <laughs> we ended up going late. And uh, we ended up missing, like, the main girls. We ended up catching the fucking, I won't even say the B squad. We caught the C squad. <laughs> we caught them, mm -hmm. them raggedy, the young bitches. You know what I'm saying? The ones that had to be. Prove theyself before they could get a real slot and make real money. Like they was, they was definitely like the the C squad, maybe the Z squad. Yeah, the L squad. They they, they ain't took no W's yet. They was the L squad. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even think they was afternooners. They was the fucking. 2 a.m.ers to 5 a.m.ers. You know what I'm saying? They got to do the dumb shift. They got to deal with all the drunk, dumb motherfuckers who really wasn't spending no money because they was broke. They had done spent all the money that they was really going to spend that fucking, <laughs> that night. I don't even remember that. I know because you really? was more, he because he kept saying, oh, I'm not faded. I'm not faded. But I knew he was more faded than he was leading He'd be on. like, this is how you know when he's faded. He'd be like, I'm not faded. Mm hmm I'm not faded. I'm just chill. I'm but his chill. ass was fucking like, loaded. Smiling. Mm -hmm. He was eating edibles, smoking hella weed with us, fucking drinking. I know that nigga was lit. Lit. Talking about, I don't even remember the strip club. Damn. <laughs> That's the homie, though. Whenever you're ready to come back, though. He said the first day I was the most faded I've ever been. I believe it. Because you just, like, you didn't say really anything that whole first day. <laughs> like, I picked him up from the airport. We got high, like, like right when we pretty much <laughs> picked him up pretty much. And then he pretty much, like, the whole day maybe said 100 words. The whole first day. Like, he just didn't have a whole lot to say. He was just lit. Yeah, that shit was funny. I, I do remember that. He didn't say shit, like, the whole first day. That shit. <laughs> that shit was hella funny. Oh, shit. That Denver bud is beyond fire, hands down, better than mm -hmm. Vegas bud. Yes, indeed. Uh -huh. Yes, indeed. And yeah, and Zach got to try it because I brought some fucking Colorado bud when I went and saw him out in Vegas and we tried the Vegas weed. I think he went, he actually went and tried Vegas weed on his own. And then. He got it delivered, I think. Yeah, I think, yeah, I'm pretty sure he tried it on his own and then he tried the Colorado weed with us. I think I had brought what wedding cake and I, I brought know. yeah I brought wedding cake and some other stuff. Don't know like one or two other things. It was yeah we got lit. That shit was fire. <laughs> fire, fire. Yeah, that was down bad. Yeah, <laughs> that shit was funny. You walked up ahead of me that blunt. I was like what. I spent way, way too much cash that first time. I'm saying, yeah. 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 Dad, I don't like the man. She'll tell you. Like I had such 
a bad experience the first time I went to the dispensary in Vegas. Because we were actually out in Vegas the first weekend of... I signed a lease in ATL today. What? <laughs> so you got an apartment in Atlanta now, nigga? <laughs> what do you mean you just signing leases in other states? Come sign a lease out here and let me rent that shit from you. <laughs> shit. But, uh... Yeah, can you do that? <laughs> For real. There's a $3,000 a month house right down the street. <laughs> we trying to get it. Um, what was I about to say? I don't even remember. That fucked me all up. That's fucked up. <laughs> oh, yeah. The first time we, we bought weed. We We went and bought weed when we were, uh, you should send me. <laughs> Hell no. Nah, I can't. I'm not sending nothing through the mail. That's illegal. That's illegal. <laughs> That's illegal. Uh, yeah, yeah, there's 3, a house. They want $2,995. $2,995 a month. Bro. So you might as well say three grand. Like, bruh. <laughs> yeah, that's just retarded. Mm -hmm. Like, all the houses on this in this neighborhood now are going for over 400000 pretty much. All the houses are selling for over 400000 pretty much. Like, you can get a one-bedroom. I saw I was looking up just places that were for sale over here. There's a one bedroom, one bath condo for two hundred and ten thousand dollars. <coughs> well, yeah. Two hundred and ten thousand dollars for a one bedroom, one bath condo. Like what? That don't even make sense. <laughs> for real. Hey, look, he said both his. Mm -hmm. Both his apartments are that combined. What up, stinky butt cheeks? We're on live. What are you doing? You should go get us a water. You go grab me a water? Really? You love me too. <laughs> yeah, it's just crazy how expensive it is. Right, go grab me a water real fast, please. One of those water bottles. Those water bottles in the, the trash yeah. can? No, not in the trash can. In the trash can? Yeah, that shit is crazy. It's so expensive out here. Yeah, very stressful. This motherfucker said that <laughs> he's got two apartments for that. You buy a six bedroom, three bath house and 10 acres of land for that here. <laughs> <laughs> Not open. The minimum wage out here is like fifteen. Maybe? No, it's eleven. It's no, some change. It it raised. It's fourteen. It's like fourteen fifty or go, something. Go grab right? your mama's phone. Why? Go. I want to see. We're gonna Google that real fast. I'm curious. Google. <laughs> Google. I said my throat was dry. You're so disrespectful. Woo! That was good though. And you're gonna have to kill it. He's trying to. Yeah, no, nah, that fucking minimum wage is retarded. If I could move somewhere and make the same amount of money that I'm making now, I could probably be really buying a big ass house. <sighs> Out here, that's. Ugh. Terrible. Let's see. Google it. Rest, rest, rest let y'all know. The minimum wage in Mississippi is eight fifty. I just made some shine. You need to try it. Yeah, I, I want some more moonshine, <gasps> man. That should be lit. He's right. Look at yeah, this it's shit. eleven and something, right? Can you see it? Just what is it? What eleven seventy? Eleven dollars and ten cents. I told you. <clears throat> I knew it couldn't be fifteen dollars. Oh, That's why I was like, nah, I'll go Google that. What the fuck? What? It's downstairs, yeah. Okay, go. Where is it though? It's downstairs on the table. You'll see it. Just go look. In the living room? Yeah, downstairs. 
Look, oh, this is what happened. This was approved for 2020, $15 an hour minimum wage by September. I don't know that was voted on. So they're doing it in 2020 and they're raising the minimum wage to 15. Which is still ain't shit. But but that's still that. But that means that it. But was it led like a what you call it? Was it done through like legis legislator legislative stuff or was it all just votes? Because if it was all just like. No, see, I know I've heard like about a it. Petition see, type. Situation, Colorado cities can raise minimum wage. See, starting. can raise. So that means it's not a mandatory. It wasn't. But that's a what I'm saying. Raise. They can actually raise raise it so yeah. people can live. So they're not gonna work for you if they can't live. Yeah, but that, but it still doesn't. If enough cities don't raise it, you know, like together, then they don't have to. And then the thing I remember too is, private companies don't have to abide by those minimums. They have to go by. They just have to follow federal minimums, and the federal minimum is still, I think, nine dollars or eight something. Ah, oh that is so dumb. Yeah. Yep. Like private company, that's why private companies they'll just compete with like whatever is competitive, but they just don't they don't have to. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It sucks when you can't live, man. You know you you can't. Let me see that Mohican face. <laughs> Hold on. The Mohican. What the fuck? The Ryan Upchurch story. <laughs> Jacob thinks he's hard, but his woman says he has to take Viagra to get harder. <laughs> That's messed up. <laughs> Wild Turkey's always talking shit. Yeah, he's been talking shit for a whole year. That's the dude, though. He's funny. He be making some crazy-ass memes. <laughs> his memes be off the chain. They be wild. Uh, it's come thing big, plant-based products for... A better way of life, basically. It's cannabis, everything. Okay. I'll look into it. I'll check it out. Dude had me cracking up the other day watching that. <laughs> yeah. That shit was crazy. Ew. Yeah. My bad, bro. Yeah, no, that uh, new video he did, he dropped yesterday. Or la yeah, last night in the morning, or this morning, technically. I'm going to uh, go ahead and... Uh... Oh, dang, yeah, she did lost a whole lot of weight. Yeah. Right. She lost a whole lot of weight. Yeah. Um, what was I about to say? Oh, yeah. I'm going to do it tomorrow. <laughs> That's all I was getting to. I'm doing that shit tomorrow. When the next song I'm driving, ain't no way you done. To, you done. <laughs> you a one and done. No, I ain't. Ask her. No, we. I, it's, I, I made up a rap. I, I'm sending you it. Hear it Trap? I'm sending it. I sent it to the dude who did the hook, and uh, he's gonna help me kind of like work out the volume stuff, and then we're gonna try to do a video for it. But I'm working on something else. That's just me because I think that song is gonna take a minute since we're gonna actually try to make it sound right and all that. And I'm gonna just do some other shit on my own. But I gotta make a, I got one, I gotta find some more beats or make some more beats. And then, yeah, but I've been writing though. If I was able to get on my goddamn computer, it's just dead. I'd be able to pull up some shit, show you some shit, you know what I'm saying, bro? I, you know what I'm saying, show you some shit, bro. Shit. I've been writing. Ask Renee. I wrote one the other day that was pretty dope. It was super deep. It's pretty cool. I just gotta put a beat to that shit. It'd be lit. I start my last week tomorrow before the new job. Hell yeah, congratulations on that shit, bruh. Yeah, Trav, and when are you gonna come out here? I'm telling you, I wanna get on the track with you. I wanna get on the track. We need to get on the track. You know what I'm saying? Let's do it, bruh. Let's do it. I'm telling you, must be some crazy. You don't want to sign me, right? You don't want to sign me, dog. <laughs> <laughs> I 
how you lose all that weight? Like, <laughs> why you saying like I was 300? Like, <laughs> man. Oh, man, that's hilarious. What did you say? What? Yeah, we need some high trap like beats plus that love. See, everybody, they want that my high trap song, bruh. Shit. God damn fly. Boys aren't supposed to take it like that. <laughs> he felt really disrespectful. You're right. He'd be good. Tell you to talk, start the shit for that. I'm just saying. And yeah, I'm sure he has been talking shit for longer than a year. I'm just saying he's been talking shit for me for a year on YouTube. This motherfucking stupid fly, though. I want to smack it. Get him. Catch him. That was like... I caught him. No, you didn't. Yes, the fuck I did. He's no. in my hand. Why are you shake it? Don't. You didn't catch you him. You want to hear him? You didn't catch him. Hear him. Get out of here. Where is he at? Right there. Oh. His ass is right there, even. I hate that fly. That fly is annoying. I have to kill him. I've got to kill him. <sighs> Look, he's right here. Ew, you just fucking spit on me. I think I... I got him! I motherfucking got him. You are so... Don't! Why would you hit that? I hit it over Why there. No, the fuck you did didn't. it hit you? Does it fucking matter? Did it hit it's you? dead right dead, there. Dead, dead too. Bro. Fuck that fly. That's what I gotta say. Why would you fucking do that? <laughs> it didn't hit you. I don't care. You be alright. You shit. be alright. I am because I killed that motherfucker. Take a drink. <laughs> Take a drink. <laughs> Take a drink, I hope it's good. Take a drink. It's gonna be good. Take a drink. Don't don't give me a purple nurple. That shit hurt. <sighs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Couldn't do it. Like a ninja. You saw that shit? I said, whoa! Y'all need to go back and fucking record that shit. That's you know what I'm fucking saying? gross. <laughs> You saw that he shit. He always doing that shit. I be catching them like be catching when I sit here and tell y'all like, like I be catching them like I've really caught these motherfuckers in midair. I'm mid like Psh! and like throwing them on the ground and shit. They be bouncing. <laughs> like, fuck you, yes, stupid so fly. Gross. I fucking hate flies. It's like my mission in life to kill flies, bro. I can't believe you just flicked that fucking fly at me. I flicked him that way. You're fucking. Look, gross. I think it's way the fuck over there. You lie. I'm telling you. He about to become a zombie fly. I never said I was gonna eat a goddamn fly. <laughs> <laughs> what size shirt y'all wear? I got uh, y'all yeah, some, but I got some more coming. I'm gonna send. Okay, for sure. I um, wear size voluptuous. <laughs> a large. <laughs> hey! And, and I'll take a large too. <laughs> I wear size voluptuous. I'll take a large too. So, you know what I'm saying? Some larges. I don't know. A hundred bucks, I'm not eating a fly. A thousand dollars, maybe. You know, maybe a thousand dollars. I wish you I would, would eat it. a fucking fly. For a thousand dollars? No, bruh. A thousand dollars, I'd do it. I'd do it for a thousand dollars. You're disgusting. <laughs> it's just a fly. You're fucking gross. For a thousand dollars, I'd do it. <laughs> Not for a thousand, bro. No. <laughs> All right, maybe maybe like ten thousand. Maybe like ten thousand. Ten thousand, I'd probably do it. I ain't gonna lie. Ten thousand, I'd really probably do it. <laughs> you give me ten thousand, I I would definitely do it. Is a spider behind me? Where? Oh, there's a lot of fucking webs, too. Where do you see a spider? Don't play games with me. I don't fucking like spiders. I don't fucking like spiders either. Where the fuck you see a spider at? Or was he fucking with us? I don't know. Don't fuck with us about spiders. Look, like light skin oh. ass niggas. <laughs> <laughs> don't be talking shit, trap. Shit. Hell nah, spider, you gotta pay, that's probably a million dollars. 
you'd have to set me up for life for me to do a spider. I'm not just doing that shit for no reason. Uh-huh. Sorry. Uh-huh. Nope. I don't think there's enough weed in the world that could let, make me eat a spider. I'm fucking terrified of spiders. Mm-mm. Oh, I think that I know what they're talking about. I think he said, I got look, your asses. I'm pretty sure he was trying to like get. No, look. he was just fucking Cause with Because in the screen, that looks kind of like a spider right there. Mm-mm. Fried tarantula in Thailand. Fuck that. I'm not eating candy spiders either. I won't even walk in the same room as a tarantula right, for one right. candy. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, I'm good. And fried cockroaches? I eat a cockroach before I eat a motherfucking spider. But you'd have to still pay me for the cockroach. It might cost less. Why the fuck would you need a cockroach? It would cost less, is what I'm saying. Like, I would take like seven hundred and fifty thousand to eat a cockroach, where I'm I need like flat fee a million dollars to eat a, eat a spider. You gotta set me up, my nigga. <laughs> Kelsey put a video. Yes, I saw that of him eating that goddamn fucking dead fucking zebra tarantula, and I was like, why would you do that to yourself? That was retarded. I would, especially for a video that, like, no. That didn't even go trending or nothing? Hell no. Ew. Ew. <laughs> Love you, Kelso. I'm not doing that shit, Hell though, bro. Hell no. You got me fucked up. I'm all itchy and shit. Like, nigga. <sighs> uh, Ten k. uh-uh. No. Not eating a spot. I'll eat 10K. the whole buffet for 50. For 50 bucks. <laughs> Uh, he's, I don't give a damn that I eat seven spiders a year while I'm sleeping. I'm sleeping so that I don't, you know what I mean? I'm sleep. And I sleep with a blanket over my head, so I probably don't eat as many as the rest of y'all. Just keeping it a hundred. <laughs> <laughs> I'm that terrified of spiders. I worked on the car one time. The customer had a half-eaten box of salt and vinegar crickets. Dude ate them like candy. That's so gross. <laughs> that is so gross. Why not eat bull testicles? Because that's gross too. Nobody wants Rocky Mountain oysters. Mm-mm. That mm. sounds nasty. So where do we draw the line? We draw the line at... I just don't eat none of that. I eat sushi. I'll fuck with sushi. Certain kinds of sushi. I'm not eating everything though. I'm, a, I'm more of a basic sushi kind of guy. Like basic sushi, California rolls. You know what I mean? Shit like that. Basic. Don't give me nothing extravagant. I don't want nothing that I can't pronounce. Who's sushi have you tried? Like real sushi, California rolls. Whose sushi were you trying? Back in the day, a lot. (laughs) Everybody's sushi. Not to beat your ass. (laughs) Everybody's sushi back in the day. I heard fried frog legs were fire. We had frog legs. Did we? We were in Mississippi. Did I? Yeah. Oh my goodness. I'm pretty sure we had frog legs. We had alligator tail. We had the hush puppy thing. Oh, you right. We had crab. We had, we had all Sweet. sorts of shit when we was out there. We ate all sorts of things out of the ordinary for us. And something, a lot of things that weren't. That's all we did was eat. Mm-hmm. We did. That's all we did. Yeah, we had Snake gator. is good. We didn't have snake, though, but I've had snake, snake before. Snake is good. I think that was all we had when we was out there. Yeah, y'all ate all that country shit. Oh, yeah. We found quail eggs in a gas station down there. They were pickled quail eggs. It was so funny. Trap don't eat nothing down there pretty much. Like, (laughs) he's a picky ass eater. He He was like disgusted by all the shit we was eating. He was not fucking with Mexican food. He don't eat nothing. Nah, Trap didn't break us in. We went and broke ourselves in. Because Trap don't eat nothing extravagant. He eats basic shit, too. He's basic. You real basic. <laughs> when it comes to his diet, he's the, that nigga eats eggs every day. All day. <laughs> That's my nigga. But he does not like to eat the extravagant kinds of food. It was kind of even hard trying to take him out to eat places here because he was just, he wanted the exact same things he eats all the fucking time. We was like, no, nah, I don't want to try that. That's different. <laughs> no, nah, we're not going to go. No. Yeah. So, yeah. 
And we broke ourselves in. We was eating any and everything, pretty much. We was just trying shit to try. We wouldn't even know if it would taste good. We was like, fuck it, let's order it. <laughs> pretty much. Yeah. And which was crazy for her, because she she's kind of picky, too. She's more of like a, when we go out to eat, she'll eat the same things, too. So it was kind of crazy for her to kind of get out of her shells with that when we was down there. But she tried a lot of cool things, too. She liked a lot of it, too. I think there's a few things she wasn't really feeling, but she liked the majority of it. I don't think there was really anything that we didn't like, that we like were like, ew. There were just a few things that we were just like, nah. You know, it could have been better. You know what I'm saying? It was just a few of those. We like the off the wait off the wall hole in the wall spots when we travel. Yeah, that's when you. That's Remember where you we find had that heat. pizza out in Vegas. Yeah. That was fire. Mm -hmm. That Chinese joint in Vegas was legit. Which one? Hold on. Is it, none of the menu was in English. We resorted to point at the menu. <laughs> yeah, I've done that before where you just look at pictures like, I want that. <laughs> you ain't got no grits in Colorado. I'm supposed to eat for breakfast. Eggs, nigga. Eggs. That's what you'll eat for fucking right. breakfast, nigga. Eggs. That's all you eat anyway. <coughs> you don't even make grits all the time. You just You eat grits when you go out. But when you at home, you don't eat no goddamn grits, nigga. You eat eggs. Every time I call your ass in the morning, you call me in the morning, your ass is making eggs. Nothing else, nigga. Eggs. <laughs> like, let's keep it on it. You eat your ass some eggs. <laughs> he said that's how I survived in Korea and Dubai. Dubia. Dubia. Damn. Arguing with my oldest. I know how that go. <laughs> I'm tired of it. I even said that. I was like, you guys be tired of eggs. Mm. But I don't get tired you of like eggs. That's why I eat it all the I time. I can't remember. I told you. You didn't like avocado either. He don't eat nothing. And now he's tired of eggs. <laughs> Her oldest is 18. Whew. I'm not ready for that. I don't even sound fun. Mm. I'm about to go in here and put Lynn to bed. Yep. I'm coming with you, I guess. Okay. It was hot out Bye, here. Bye, everybody. It's hot yeah, as fuck. Yeah, it's hot as shit out here. I'm about to go in the house. <clears throat> and I got to get up in the morning and take my kids to school. So, man, back on the school schedule. <sighs> Stop itching your fucking scabs. You're not a child. Fuck. <laughs> stop. That shit is gross as fuck. Like you almost stop. Well, stop. Off. You kept getting it. You're not a fucking child. <laughs> Bro, that's dis... All right. Bye, y'all. He's retarded. <laughs> <laughs> You're retarded. Love y'all. <laughs> There's no me without you. <laughs> Ow. That's why... That's Look, karma... That was fun coming back at your ass. I'll catch y'all tomorrow. We'll go live tomorrow. Uh, probably in the morning at some time. Probably in the morning. We'll probably do an early morning smoke sesh. You know what I'm saying? Um, not on Patreon. We'll just do it on here. I'm going to figure out the Patreon thing, and then I'll give y'all another. Uh, we'll probably do it like, I want to do it on like a Sunday when like I know people are chilling and shit. You know what I'm saying? Because I know during the week, it's hard. And it's easier for people to catch youtube and just hop in and hop out during the week so i want to do um yeah i saw that judith i appreciate you i do i'm gonna send you a, a a patreon message as well um but yeah i want to just give i want to i want patreons to be on sundays um so i might just go ahead and figure out how to do it and then we might do like a test live during the week for patreon but then we'll do like an actual the real patreon live <laughs> on a uh, Sunday coming up and then yeah <laughs> yeah that's all I gotta say about that um I gotta do some reactions tomorrow we'll get some reactions done we'll get some shit you know out for you tomorrow as well and I think that's it oh I'll probably work on another song tomorrow too there might just be another little low budget little look we're gonna call them low budget bangers you know what i'm saying i'm gonna give y'all another low budget banger you know what i mean 
<laughs> and yeah, we'll have a good motherfucking time. But yeah, I love y'all. There is no me without you. Always remember to live your life high, man. Y'all have a great motherfucking start to your week. Um, if you're tuning in from the other side of the world and it's already Monday and you already started your week, you have a good continuation to your week. And uh, good vibes only, man. I love y'all. There is no me without you. And yeah, I love y'all. Peace. <laughs> Always remember the life high. Honestly, tell you, genuine, humble. Look yourself in the mirror. Tell yourself that you're real sexy because confidence is key. And uh, I'll see y'all later. Peace. Oh, yeah, and you can hit the, if you want to donate, don't let me forget. If you want to donate, hit Cash App, dollar sign, my high floating. PayPal is paypal.me slash Jacob J0595. J A C O B, letter J0595. Patreon, patreon.com slash mile high. See y'all later.